I hope you had a wonderful Christmas and I hope you're enjoying your holidays. Uh, I had a wonderful time with my family and I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm going to be taking a little break. If you have noticed, I haven't been putting out videos that often lately and that's because I've been very, very busy and it has been really, really hard for me to be creative. So I need this little break uh, in order for me to uh, just have some quiet time and just create, you know, just let my imagination run wild and, you know, and just be passionate about what I want to do, which I haven't had time to because I've been so busy. And that's what I kept telling my husband. I haven't had time to think. I haven't been having, to, I need creative time. That's what I told them. I need time to be creative and you know i'm just go 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 and i haven't had time to be creative so i'm gonna take this time to just um think <laughs> and be creative because everything that i do is you know i have to have passion behind it my career before this uh when i did television i loved it you know and even before that through high school and through college I was a waitress and I loved it so everything that I do that I put out for you I have to love it and if I don't love it I don't want to put it out so I had a lot of doubts on things that you know I wanted to do and I wasn't thinking you know I just it didn't feel right so um, I feel that right now it's a good time since my daughter is out of school I can spend some family time with her or mother-daughter time with her you know and my husband uh, yeah, so I will see you guys on January 4th. It's a Thursday, so that's going to be a um, celebrations video. And then I will follow with a wedding video, and then I will start again with my quick and easy videos. Yeah, and also, <laughs> by the way, my hair on this side broke off really, really bad. So I might be getting a haircut. So the next time you see me, I might look a little different. So yeah, so get ready for that. Or maybe not, because I'm still a little chicken about that. I've been thinking about it on and off, on and off. And um, so I decided that maybe on this break, I will go ahead and get my hair cut. So we shall see. <laughs> uh, yeah, so before I go, I wanted to um, tell you about something that is really dear to my heart. I've been doing this for the last couple of years um, and I wanted to share it again this year when I did it the first time I didn't have a lot of subscribers so hopefully you guys can um, join the movement uh, I'm talking about blessing boxes uh, blessing blessing boxes are boxes of anything that you know you can think of toiletries anything that will benefit a homeless person out there or somebody in need um, i buy boxes from dollar tree and i fill it with toiletries little snacks and just things that i think a person um, out there that's homeless or somebody that might need it you know can benefit from and um and if you can join me and do this uh two boxes per person we can reach a lot of people. You know, sometimes you might not have change in your pocket and you see a homeless person at the stop sign or at the traffic light and then you say, you know what, I don't have cash, but guess what, I have something better. Here's this blessing box. So that's basically my purpose for uh, telling you about this and I'm gonna show you how to do it right now. And any box will do, but I love these clear boxes from Dollar Tree uh, because they are sturdy and because they will keep everything safe in case of bad weather. And you can find this at Walmart, Target, pretty much anywhere. So what I do is I make two boxes minimum and I will make one for a lady and one for a man. And I will just fill them up with things that I think they may need. Uh, so I use, I usually do two snacks but this is only for winter time because you will carry this in the trunk of your car. So when you run into someone, you can go ahead and you know gift it to them. So um, for the winter, I will place two snacks here. Here I have a couple of cups of noodles and chicken salad. But for summertime, it will be wise to get a gift card, $10, $5 to any restaurant, Subway, McDonald's, I'm not sure if McDonald's have gift cards, but um, yeah, to any restaurant and you can place it in there instead of the actual snack. And then you can also place the deodorant, soap, razors, uh, toothpaste, toothbrush, 
and this year I'm placing uh, always maxi pads for a lady and then this year I'm also I found this cute little Bibles uh, at Dollar Tree and I'm placing that in there because you never know who needs saving <laughs> uh, and I'm also I'm going to uh, take a couple of these out and these are tissue tissue paper some um, hand sanitizer and then I'm also going to place some gum in there just for fun you know um, and I shouldn't say fun because I know that it's not fun for you know any homeless person to you know not have the bare minimum so please 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 join me and you know make a box for someone out there in need leave it in your car and when you see them at the stop sign or at the stoplight uh, even if you're feeling like okay I don't want to give them cash because I don't know if the money's gonna go to you know to food or to something you know at least this you will have peace of mind that is going to be used for something good all right guys I hope you guys can join me in this uh, and I will see you guys next time